guys, over here. Today I'm doing the Eureka Math Grade 4 Module 1 Lesson 10 Homework. So let's get started. Number 1. Round 845,001 to the nearest thousand. So, thousand um, will be this place value and we are round this to 845,000 because there's only one, and if we wanted to round it up to 846,000, we needed a five here, because that's not enough. And 10,000 um, would be this one. We round it to 850,000, because we have 845,000, and the five would round, would round the whole number up to 850,000. And now 100,000, um, we would round it to 800,000. We round it down, because we need at least 850,000 to round it up to 900,000. And number two, complete each statement by rounding the number to the given place value. So 783 rounds the nearest hundred would be 800. Um, 12,781 nearest hundred would be um, 12,800. 951,194 to the nearest 100, um, which is over here, would be 951,200. And 1,258 rounded to nearest 1,000 would go back to 1,000. 65,124 to the nearest 1,000 would, um, this is the nearest 1,000, be 65,000. 99,451 to the nearest thousand would just be 99,000. And G, 60,488 to the nearest 10,000, which is this one. Um, that would just be 60,000. 80,801 to the nearest 10,000. Um, it would round still to 80,000. Uh, 897,100 to the nearest 10,000, which is this one, um, it would actually be nine. Because, okay, we're rounding this one, so we have to add one more, but we can't, so that'd be 900,000. All right, and J, we have 880,005 to the nearest 100,000. So over here, we round to the nearest 100,000. So 880,005, would be 900,000. And then K, 545,999 to nearest 100,000 again. Um, that would actually round down to 500,000. And L, 689,114 to the nearest 100,000 would be 700,000 because we're passing the halfway mark, kind of, and so then we would round up. All right, next page. Number three, solve the following problems using pictures, numbers, or words. A. In the 2011 New York City Marathon, 29,867 men finished the race and 16,928 women finished the race. Each finisher was given a t-shirt about how many men's shirts were given away, um, about how many women's shirts were given away. Explain how you found your answers. All right, so let's round our answers. So for the men's, they have 29,800. 67 and if we round if we want to round by 10,000 that would round to 30,000 and for a woman 16,928 would round to um let's see 16 it would round to 20,000 if we're running by 10,000 because Six is greater than five, so we would go round up. So in 30,000 men's um, 
shirt and 20,000 woman shirt. So yeah. And how we find our answers? Well, if we're, so this one we're rounding up and this one we're rounding um, also up. So we round them up and we um, round them up. Yeah, we basically, we basically just round the two numbers up by 10,000 to find these two numbers, which are our answer. So that's how we found our answer. And B, in the 2010 New York City Marathon, 42,429 people finished the race and received a medal. Before the race, the medals had to be ordered. If you were the person in charge of ordering the medals and estimated how many to order by rounding, would you have ordered enough medals? Explain your thinking. All right, so let's take a look at this problem, actually. We have 42,429 people. So if I'm going to round that, I would round that. So 42,000, if we're rounding, um, we were round to 40,000. But then that's not really enough. But the real problem to be asking, question to be asking is, well, how many people signed up? So like, ask if I was the person in charge. So if there is an event with rewards, it would be better to have too many than not enough. So for me, I would round up instead of rounding down. So I would round to like 45,000, maybe possibly 50,000. But I think I would have run up um, for me if I was in charge because I would want to have enough. So for 42,429, I would have run it up. And so, we were, I, so I would have had enough if I ran up. But then, um, so it's basically like depending if you run up or run down. Because if you run it down, you wouldn't have enough. But if you run it up, then you would have enough. So, um, basically, if you round up, you would have enough. So, if you round up, you have enough. Have, um, but if you round down you wouldn't have enough all right basically you just wouldn't have enough if you run it down so yeah I, so i would have run it up so that's what i would have done and see in 2010 28,357 of the finishers were men and 14,072 of the finishers were women but how many more men finished the race of women? To determine your answer, do you round to the nearest 10,000 or 1,000? All right, so I'm going to choose to run round to the nearest 1,000 because 1,000s are smaller than 10,000. So then um, it'll be a bit more accurate and closer to the real numbers. So 28,357. The nearest 1,000, it would round to 28,000. And then we have 14,072 to the nearest um, um, thousand, we would round it to 14,000. So then how many more men finished than women? Well, 28,000 minus 14, 14,000 would be 14,000. So, 14,000 more men. Oh yeah. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video helps. And please don't forget to like and subscribe because it really helps out my channel. See you next time, bye.